should get a pet. Yeah, but I'm allergic to dogs. Cats don't like me. Horses need too much space. I'm scared of mice. Bunny rabbits, way too fluffy. And I'd get a bird, but they'd give me migraines. Plus, my parents won't even let me get a venomous snake. Oh. But what do you got there, Sharon? Oh, this? This is Charlie. He's my pet rock. A pet rock? You can't have this one. Oh, no. But, well, could, could you teach me how to make one? Oh, yeah, sure. First things first, you'll need to find a rock. Try looking outside, maybe ask your parents to go out to the driveway to find a pebble. Once you've found a rock that catches your eye, find the materials to decorate it. I'm going to paint mine, so I'm getting some newspaper, paint, cleaning water, paint brushes, and the rock or rocks I want to paint. You can also use some other decorative materials, like googly eyes or feathers. To paint the rocks, start by doing a coat on one side using a paintbrush or dipping it into the paint, then smoothing it out. Experiment with the colours you want to use and the patterns you want to make. You could even paint on some eyes. When the rock is dry, you can flip it over and paint the other side and add on any extra patterns. Once they've dried fully, your rocks should be perfect pets. You could even make a whole family of them. And last but not least, don't forget to give your rock a name. This is Janine, Roxy, Tiger, Rex, Barney, Barney Jr, Molly and Christopher II.